in an event that sent shock waves through the automotive industry. Ford CEO Jim Farley made a groundbreaking announcement that could potentially alter the trajectory of not only his company but the entire electric vehicle, EV, industry. Farley revealed that Ford has developed a revolutionary new engine, one that he claims has the power to disrupt and possibly dismantle the current momentum behind electric vehicles. This announcement comes at a time when the EV industry is experiencing rapid growth, spurred on by environmental concerns, government regulations, and consumer demand for greener transportation solutions. However, Ford's new engine could introduce a seismic shift in how both manufacturers and consumers view the future of mobility. Jim Farley, ever the visionary leader, has been known for pushing boundaries and embracing innovation during his tenure at Ford, the company's legacy of producing powerful, efficient combustion engines was not something he was willing to abandon entirely. Even as the world shifted its focus to electric powertrains, Farley's latest reveal marks Ford's reassertion of its prowess in traditional engineering but with a modern twist. The engine he presented promises to deliver efficiency, power, and performance far beyond what anyone might expect from a combustion engine, leading some to speculate that it could stall the seemingly inevitable rise of electric vehicles. At the heart of this announcement is the bold claim that Ford's new engine surpasses all current alternatives in terms of fuel efficiency, power output, and sustainability, according to Farley. This engine is a technological marvel that blends traditional internal combustion engine, I see, engineering with groundbreaking innovations that significantly reduce emissions. In fact, Farley highlighted that this engine produces fewer emissions than many hybrid or plug-in hybrid vehicles, calling into question the prevailing narrative that electric vehicles are the only viable solution for a sustainable future. The reduced emissions, he suggested. Make this engine not only a greener choice than most current combustion engines but also a contender to rival even the most efficient EVs. One of the most surprising aspects of this announcement was the timing. The global auto industry is deep in the throes of an electric revolution. Major automakers, including Ford itself, have announced plans to phase out combustion engines entirely over the next few decades. Billions of dollars are being poured into EV infrastructure, battery development and renewable energy resources to support the rapid scaling of electric vehicles. Yet here was Farley, standing on a stage and proclaiming that Ford had found a way to breathe new life into the internal combustion engine, something that many had written off as a relic of the past. The implications of this new engine technology are enormous. For one, it challenges the assumption that electric vehicles are the inevitable successors to traditional cars. While EVs have garnered significant support due to their zero-emission status and impressive technological advancements, they are not without their drawbacks, concerns about battery production, charging infrastructure, and the sourcing of rare earth metals have been constant thorns in the side of the EV industry. Ford's new engine offers an alternative path, one that promises to bypass many of the complications associated with electric vehicles while still delivering on the demands for lower emissions and improved efficiency. Farley was keen to emphasize that this new engine is not just about performance and power, it is also about affordability. One of the biggest hurdles facing the electric vehicle industry is the high cost of batteries and the corresponding price of electric vehicles themselves. While prices have come down in recent years, electric cars remain out of reach for many consumers, particularly in emerging markets where infrastructure is less developed. Ford's new engine, on the other hand, could provide a lower-cost alternative to electric vehicles, making sustainable driving accessible to a wider audience without requiring the same level of infrastructural overhaul. The flexibility offered by this new engine could also give Ford a strategic advantage in the global market. While electric vehicles have gained significant traction in regions like North America, Europe, and parts of Asia, many parts of the world remain reliant on traditional fuels due to a lack of charging infrastructure or the prohibitive costs associated with EVs. Ford's engine could serve as a bridge solution, offering the environmental benefits and efficiency that consumers are beginning to demand while utilizing the existing refueling infrastructure. This could allow Ford to maintain a competitive edge in markets where EV adoption has been slower and give the company a significant leg up over competitors who have gone all in on electric. It's important to consider how this new engine might influence Ford's competitors as well. Companies like Tesla, which has built its entire business around the concept of electric vehicles, may feel the pressure to adapt to this new development. Other traditional automakers like General Motors and Volkswagen, who have also pledged massive investments in EV technology, could find themselves re-evaluating their strategies.
Ford's announcement may spark a renewed focus on improving internal combustion engines, leading to a more balanced automotive landscape where both EVs and advanced combustion engines coexist. The development of this new engine also raises fascinating questions. How exactly did Ford manage to make an internal combustion engine that rivals the efficiency and emissions of electric vehicles? Farley was careful not to reveal too many specifics during the announcement, likely to protect Ford's proprietary technologies from prying eyes. But he did hint at the use of advanced materials and engine engineering processes that allow the engine to run cleaner and more efficiently than anything on the market today. These advancements may pave the way for a new era of innovation in engine design as other automakers scramble to keep up with Ford's unexpected leap forward. Ford's engineers have seemingly achieved what many thought impossible, they have given the internal combustion engine a new lease on life in an era dominated by the electrification of the automotive industry. This could have profound implications for how automakers invest in research and development moving forward. While most companies have been focusing their efforts on electric drivetrains and battery technologies, Ford's success with this engine might reignite interest in refining and improving combustion engines. It's not hard to imagine a future where automakers pursue a dual strategy, continuing to develop both electric and combustion technologies in parallel, rather than fully transitioning to electric powertrains as many had predicted.